Okay guys, I'm back here. We are flying through this end game. I think uh, where we left off, Septiana was staring at the rampart saying, I knew you were here, and now you're dead. Is there any reason not to attack? I don't think there's anything else I need to do first. Yeah, we're just doing this, right? We'll assume the water wheel's taken. I mean, there's no way we're in trouble here, even if there's a good hero here. I, um, wow. I had a look uh, on Google downstairs just now, and Eovasius is, oh, that's a shame. Eovasius is a expert at casting clone, and he uniquely is able to summon two clones. And that's why and how that happened. It's just so everyone knows. You, a lot of you probably already do know, but and you were looking at it going, oh, Paul, you moron. Uh, I didn't know that, though, as a person who hasn't played a lot of Horn of the Abyss. 575 from a meteor shower. No one's going to like that. Yeah, haven't cast meteor shower for a while. Let's do it. Ooh. Very nice. Yeah, let's kill these. Ah, good luck. Good luck is not something I need. Don't you know who I am? I am Septiano of the Necropolis. Oh, shell tremble before me. Wow, they did great damage. Look at that, 89 of them killed half a dragon. That's really good value. Alright, you guys do this. With no penalty? Oh. Oh. Death. Uh, will these guys attack? They will. That's fine. Yeah, so... Arrow Tower hopefully shoots the skellies. Yeah. Cool. Spending mana, mana a little liberally. Let me just turn my speakers down. I hope that's not feeding back into my microphone. Probably still too loud, is it? Yowza. She's got nothing left to learn, people. Level 22. And she's on the skelly train, building up her army again. Wow, let's have a look in here. Okay, we always knew this was here. Gold dragons are here. That's not surprising. What's in the mage guild? Water elemental. Okay. I think we knew most of these. I don't think we had resurrection. So that's a nice one to add to the spell book. She can teach resurrection to other people. Cool. I might swap the thingy in the tub. What is it? Wizarding well. I'm not stopping here though with my mana. I'm just coming to here. Movement points, I mean. I'm looking for an underground. What do we think? Where is it? Like it's over here somewhere, right? Yeah, in fact, this could be another continent in through here. It is. Look at that. Oh. Okay. Uh, should we... Hmm. Spend some money here. Let's spend some money. These are good. These are good, these are fine. Start spending and splashing some cash. Uh, yeah, nice one. Alright. Who's next? Stiggy? You doing this? Yeah, power. Let us become powerful. More powerful than you can ever imagine. Um, now. Why am I here? Oh, yeah, yeah, I was going to go through here, that's right. Happy with that? I think Astra's going to run out of ideas. Once they've got no towns left, she'll come and end it all, shall we say? In here, where I can now do this. And maybe invest. Should we go for this? I love these guys. These are so good, these guys. Look at that. I love this. I feel like I'm, 
investing back in the community for that I've stolen from so profoundly. Yeah, let's make some more investments here too. Cage of Warlords. Captain's Quarters. We know we're going to want dragonflies, right? What should I do? Should I just go for these? How about some gorgons? We'll do this. We'll do that today. Okay, cool. Actually, while you're here, Ranlu, what did she decide to do? She still let you live. You are so jammy. This actually looks decent, this crystal. Yeah, this is worth a shout, right? Although, I could wait. Let's do this first, because it's day three. I don't think Jem's coming down here. Okay, this would have been quite good to come and visit, but never mind. Stig, what did we say? Yeah, you're coming back out this way. I don't think she's flagging that. She could, though, before she jumps in there. G is just waiting. Aiden's just waiting. We're all just waiting. You know what you're doing. This is worthwhile. A hundred peasants. Oh, boy. Yes, I'm so sorry, guys. A hundred of them. Lambs to the slaughter. Tons of boars over here too. Or should I go get them? <laughs> or maybe. I'll grab that on the way. These guys are really slow. He's going from. I think I'm obligated to slaughter as many, you know, innocent pilgrims of the countryside as I'm able to. Um, that does kind of come with the territory. What happened to Blue here? What is Jeremy doing? He's going to go home, but home is just the fortress. We kind of want to force him to do that though, right? Because we don't really want him galloping around here. So by coming here, I force the issue. Yeah, that's good. Nagash is still just waiting here like a loser. Happy. Very, very happy. Happy with all this. I don't think we need to defend this any harder. Could think about upgrading somebody, but nah. Okay, we're in the ascendancy here. What did he do in the end? Oh, okay, we hmm, don't like seeing our enemies get Pandora's boxes. That's not good. Who is that? So I find in this late part of the game, in the tidy up phase, maybe as we'll call it, it's a good idea to ask the question of your opponent. What can you do? Oh, he's got another big pile of haspids. How did you pull that off? Corks. All right, well, I can't beat corks. I need um, Septiana to do that. Even then, it's going to be hard. Oh, man, there's tons more hydras. I wondered if we needed to come up here and deal with this because of this high, extra Hydra Pond. Hydras are such a problem. Um, so let's say six or eight or so there. Yuck. Mm. Okay, yeah, the game's not over. Septiana could still die. Um, or, you know, suffer a bad defeat. The game's not over, but... What could I learn there? What could I possibly need to learn? Town gate. Nice. That's a town gate, just like the one that's underground for us. Which way is the town? This way? It's just a portal. Hmm. A portal to another world. Does that come out here? No, here? Where have I seen that other side of that portal? Have I seen that before? Look at it tear and shreds through that army. So Eris. Eris is here, but we're not too worried about that, right? Yeah. Where is this other cove that has 
all these other cool creatures in it. Do I just go through here? I think so, right? Oh, it's down here, but it doesn't look like there's a town down here. It looks like it might be a shipyard at the bottom of this. Yeah. That's really useful to know that that town portal is there. That particular object becomes really valuable <laughs> in a game with no town portal. I kind of just want to flag this. Ugh. Please. I'm just going to take this, right? There's no need to. I don't want to hire any. I just don't want... Yeah, I don't want to hire any. I never learned artillery. Oh, well. All losses are irrevocable. I should have thought about that. I don't think I want to use that. Mm, yes, I do, actually. Corpses disappear immediately after death. Spells that may revitalize the creature are banned. Vampirism doesn't bring... Undead cannot be raised. I wonder if Phoenix has come back is the only thing. I actually think denying resurrect is kind of nice here. Health plus one isn't as good. Yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. Let's have that on. Because I'll forget later. Let's face it. I don't want to surrender. Yeah, you can't lightning bolt me. That's really good to have when you've got them in your army because they're extremely vulnerable. Yeah. As I found out last uh, the last time I played Conflux. Stiggy. Now what happened? He went home but we don't know where. Did he go to the fortress? Is that him there? That's him, isn't it? Behind Coolmire? Yeah, I can't use the town portal to follow him. But that's fine. When I pop back up here, I can just finish these guys off with Rissa. Her army's strong enough to do that. Yeah. Who's going to do this? I'll do it. And... Stockpile might be good, actually. Just worried about our crystal count again now. Uh, yeah, do this for us. I don't really want to sack that. I think it's satyrs have already been bought by uh, Thingy. It'll tell me. Oh, there's four there. Okay. I don't want to turn them into skellies. I don't want to hire them and just have them sitting around either. Come down and do this job. That's actually quite useful. Now... Now that that's being dealt with, back here, you could just keep Astra at bay. Don't need to do that though. Okay, so let's stay in the area. Okay, with all that. This might be wrong. Maybe I'm supposed to just hang out. I just don't like my heroes being idle. You know. Like even old Nagash here. Mm. Three heroes just waiting around kind of thing. On the other hand, this is fine, right? We're building up money. We're building up capital. Wherever Corks shows up, we're going to give him a really warm welcome. Not old Mo Andor behind the tower gates there, freezing his butt off. You know, so that that's still going to hurt Corks. We, we can't stop him, but we can definitely give him a headache, and then Septiana can come and tag him. Fortress investment, you ask? Sure. How about a wyvern mess now? There it is in the corner. Lovely. Okay. Corks. Corks, corks, corks. The 
That's your plan, really, folks? Teal, 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 you don't know what to do. Right, do we proceed with the plan here? We're not checking this out. Should I hire a hero up here? Maybe that's what I'm supposed to do, actually. Pick someone who's probably not... Yeah, probably her, right? And then... In the rampart, I think we should start. Just get someone following Septena around. Uh, Vitamina does have logistics. Archers, I'm in the rampart. Yeah, let's take the... Oh, she's level 6 as well. Oh yeah, she was our enemy once upon a time. She has a cannon? Cool. Wow, expert ballistics, wisdom, cool. She knows she's pretty good. Alright, but let's do this, and then that way we... Oh, maybe that's silly. Something like that. Um... So she's not completely useless in combat now, and she's nice and quick. Um, I'm guessing you've never been here. Do some tidying up there. Welcome on, well, welcome on board, Vitamina, even though you were once my enemy. At a young age, she showed promise as a great alchemist. It was driven from Bacardo when it was discovered that she'd been using her skills not to animate inanimate matter, but to attempt to bring life to previously living creatures. Vitamina, that is creepy. That is just downright creepy. And um, I approve. I, I, I massively approve. You're one after my own heart. Right, what is through here? What? Oh. Oh, it's here. Oh, right. That connects to there. Oh, no. That's really, really bad. <laughs> Alright, how many towns are left? They're not tied on towns, so there has to be two blue towns remaining. Oh, that's terrible. <laughs> Isn't that awful? So the question is, where are they? I think there has to be up here somewhere an underground thing that gets us in here, and there's a town down here. We kill that, and then we kill the fortress, and we're done. So the question is, should I waste Septiana's time doing that, or should she just gallop to this town portal here, come back to... The thing is, where? Where does she come back to that can actually get things done? No dimension door still really stinks. I'm obviously not staying here. My sense is that it's clear there's no other enemy heroes in this radius. I mean, if I'm wrong, let them come back and then I'll have to deal with it, but... I went through this purple thing. It spat me out here. I conquered the rampart. There's nothing else there. There's an underground access point in here somewhere, so I'm going to find it. There just has to be, right? There it is. Don't even check what's in there. I don't care. I don't want to waste the movement points. Don't need the mercury. Don't need the sulfur. Vitamina will do it. Okay, cool. There's a town down there and I'm going to get it. Once it's dead, we just have to get past that new army that they've got brewing. I just don't think Stig's strong enough now. I think this is an okay thing to do. Astra has nothing to do. Oh, she can come annoy Tamika, actually. That would be quite annoying. Darn it. Do this. Let's see how many we can get. 16. Is that it? Alright, get back here. Astra cannot beat the Conflux, right? If she goes through the green portal? No, she can't. No. Okay, cool. All right, Rissa. Yeah, you were going to feel finish teal off for me, I think, weren't you? Um, 
How much do I lose? Quite a lot. Not worth it? Probably not. Randley, you old dog. Do this. Great. That's really good. Um, mate, go for it. He's just the biggest coaster. Like, he's just a complete coaster. The others all are doing this heavy lifting, like Mo Andor, you know, and Rissa galloping all over the countryside, and he's just spent the whole time at home, and then he gallops out, and... He's a git. Randlu is a git. The others hate him. Aiden's there just going, Even I've done more than you! Look, he's fought a fight, a thousand experience, he's done something with his life. Fortress Investments Incorporated. That's just not a problem now, right? I'm just doing it for fun. Hmm. Let's get some captain's quarters going. So a captain hanging out in there. Captain of the dogs. Sticky. Come back. Chasing after Astra isn't a thing. Right, I'm not going to get to the conflux before Astra gets there, so there's no point trying. But I don't. I'm just not worried about it anyway. We have them pinned. We have them pinned down. Okay, I just hope we don't get a nasty surprise like a hero popping out of nowhere saying, "Hello, I'm back to take the town you stole." Okay, so we can do this. Might be nice to have some haspids of our own for once. These sea dogs are just wicked cool. Can't say no. And these girls are presumably awesome in a siege as well. Okay, that'll do. I don't want to overdo it. And over to... Who's the guy I want to keep an eye on? Corks. Okay, how much worse is he going to get? Mm. Could get quite a lot worse before we're ready for the big showdown. Here she comes, that's fine. Corks goes in and comes out again, and he's going to try for a big score. Okay. Right, so we need to figure out, do I have time to kill this last town, or do I need to go and confront Corks by running to here? And then town portling to here? Because he is there. Now I do have uh, an asset in the area. But this particular asset Cannot, I can disguise myself, but that doesn't matter. Yeah, his, his army is just better than mine, and I'm just going to throw away my investment. So he's definitely on a mission to kill. He's coming, right? And he's going to get to here tomorrow. You know, in a pinch, he, he, he might be there in two turns. Right, with a fair wind, he could gallop in and do the job in two turns. How sad am I? Right? If I see him coming down towards Dark Eternal, I'll just run back to Dark Eternal in the town portal, I mean. Okay, let's do Tamika first. We know that she's coming home with this helpless fodder. Yeah. To the Transformer. Right this way. And Aiden, hop behind here for a second, son. Allow me to collect the fodder from you. I'll just get these killed. Yeah, they're just dead meat, aren't they? Oh, oh it's grim. G. Oh, I can't look. Dylan, you're dead. 
You're dead. You're dead. Why did I do that? I kind of think I want um, Tamika to be the hero responsible. But I want her to be the fast, speedy one standing up here. Yeah. Let's do that. So Tamika's a great hero, ready to do loads of fighting as needed. Um, and here we have stuff, you know. Again though, I kind of have Town Portal now, but I like that it's not a good Town Portal. Right, so here's my strategy. Corks can get to here, or here, tomorrow. The next day he can maybe take this town. My strategy is... Maybe my shadow strategy should be to have Nagash waiting here. Septiana can town portal to here. When? Doesn't use all her moves. So could I pop downstairs? I'm guessing there's a town like here. I pop down here, there's a town right here. I'm just gonna get this done, people. What is that? A nymph waterfall? So yeah, there's another cove. There always had to be because there's a shack there. That's how they've been able to accumulate another big massive pile of Haspids. Jeremy is here with an army. Wow, perfect. That is perfection. Being able to actually sting him. So here's a theory. The reason blue has been so good this game... I don't know which of their coves they started in. Maybe the one on the surface. But they were able to conquer this second one pretty quickly. And they've been able to snowball into big piles of cove creatures as a result. But now we've got their number and Jeremy is going to die here behind the walls. Not a pretty picture. Okay, so glad we did it this way. Yeah, this is not going to be... This is not going to be good for you. Okay. 50 of 50, you're a terrible hero. Sorry to say. I'm thinking expert slow. Is that a waste? Yeah, they're all going to die on turn one, unless this thing flies away. Yeah, they'll all move out of the way of Death Cloud. So I'm not going to overthink this. I think this is good, right? Which means that's a weight. This is... They've all got bad morale or okay morale. Is it neutral morale? Can't tell. Is it negative morale? Is that minus one or plus one? It's minus one. They've all got minus one morale. But I don't want to give you short range. And you will have... Well, should I let these guys get a shot off? That's kind of annoying, right? Now that I'm looking at it, I kind of don't want to do what I said I wanted to do. All right. Well, that's not that good. Oh, okay. Well, what are you going to do? Yeah, but I'm just going to resurrect those bad boys. Oh! <laughs> yeah, so do I just do this? I think so, right? I, don't, I, don't, I just don't want the sea dogs shooting for very long because they're so good. So, so good. You can finish him for me. Probably. You'll probably kill one. Okay. Oh, look, yeah. Let's do that. Ooh, it is bad morale. Oh, doubly bad. I'm sorry that um, all these creatures are going to die for no gain. Yeah, that's perfect for me. Well, let's just kill these. Ooh. Oh, this is nasty. Oh, that's a terrible scream, isn't it? Um, how many are there? Three? Should be okay, shouldn't we? Yeah, as long as they go for the skellies, it's nice and tidy. Yeah, let's do that. Of this. 
bit of that. Come on back, boys. 151. Hmm. You stand safely there? That's weird. Okay. Let's do that. Ooh. Yeah. Game over. Jeremy, you probably didn't have any artifacts, did you, mate? These two pointless ones. Okay. Cool. Right, stick your head in quickly. You just never know what's in the mage guild. Although I could have checked for you and saved you the movement points, so that was a mistake. A little bit of laziness creeping in. Do I want to leave anyone back? I'm going to say no, because I'm guessing the only way in and out of here is this. So I can just buy the stupid sea dogs that are there. I want as much power as army strength as I can for the big showdown. And now is the perfect time to stock up on the wizarding well. Cool combo artifact that we're getting massive utility out of. Really love it when a plan comes together that way. So yeah, I think uh, if Cox is serious, we'd like Nagash to be standing here. So if Septiana can get to the portal in time, to portal back to here, then we're ready to give her an army to reinforce her existing one. If she can't, and he comes down and conquers this, this thing, then we're going to need to play a little bit of cat and mouse and figure out which way he's going to go, because if he comes this way, she can just stand at the town portal and wait until he moves. And then once he moves, she, she can go through the portal, because it's a one-way... Uh, one-way trip but that was absolutely worth doing you know um, we just knew there had to be a town here uh, and not surprised that it's another cove well I shouldn't be surprised anyway because of that right so yeah I don't want to challenge corks here I think the best use of Rissa is to just finish these poor saps off once and for all um, Fafner is out on the water but there's no way he can challenge me with that pathetic army. We can do this today. Teal just hasn't been a priority for some time. Yeah, let's just get it done. Okay, probably can't beat that record, especially if they go for the... Oh. Hmm, what does Rissa know apart from ballistics? 260 points of dam. Uh, I guess I'll go for the gate. Hmm. They've all waited. Well, I can kill three to eight. Let's just shoot. Okay, so lightning bolt kills him, right? And weakness. Get it here first, folks. Alright, um, we managed to keep a bird. Basic fire? No, logistics. Oh, I love that. The lookout tower. I never get sick of that feature. Uh, step on inside. There's something about stepping in that makes me feel full of power and strength and amazingness. Okay, there's no one here to hire. That's a problem. So I need you to hang around in the area until day one. That might be available, though. The Mage Tower. And this is her native town type, actually. Fun fact. So why don't you leave these guys around? Sea men? Leave them there and we'll go buy some mages and maybe hang out here for day seven. It's kind of cool. Rand Lou's just living his best life down here. He's going to learn ballistics, because why not? And uh, go and get that for me, whatever that is. Stig. Look, you're a long way from home with this army, let's face it, babe. Do that on your way, will you? There is this through here, and I could maybe use her to do some stuff through here. Bit of Mina, what can you find for me? Okay. 
don't know who this was originally. Maybe this was, you know, an enemy, um, a, tan, a tan or orange, or not orange, but uh, red maybe or something. I don't know. So there's no one else here. That's the key thing. All right. Nag. Right, so now we're going to do this. Um, quick interruption there. And, yeah, we're buying the stuff that's here. Aiden can't come out yet. Hmm. Well, Randall, I can't really afford for you to wander around here aimlessly, man. I'd love to be... I can't put Aiden... No, hang on, Aiden. Yeah, yeah, so G can go away. Ugh, come on, team. Figure it out. Okay, here we go. So we want to buy this army. Do it, I've got the money. Why do I always do that? If you push that button, it switches it off. Buy the army. Upgrade these. Go in here, come back here. Ride out. Go forth, Aiden. Swaparoo. Yep. Okay. Nag, come as far along as you can, old son. Okay, so if Septiana comes out here, we're just nicely placed to reinforce her. all on corks. What do you want to do, man? What do you want to do? Okay, they're coming back to the cove. Here he comes, here he comes. Yeah, he's on a mission. Now the thing is, the cover of darkness is still in play like it was before. Let's just have a quick look at these snow... people. Um, okay, so Fafner's dead. Unless he can gallop past me through the snow back to the base. Maybe he can. If I stand there, can he just gallop right past me and take the town back? Do I care? This fight's not even that good for Rissa. I might, I might just stay put. I was going to pop down here and do this, but I don't think I've got time now. I just don't want to risk him... Yeah, I, I just don't, there's no reason to risk it. It's, it's lazy and sort of cowardly of me. It'd be better to just fight and have some fun, but why risk it? Okay, Randall, you're actually getting things done down there, man. There's ba much bad-mouthing as I gave you. Do I want to do this? Okay, so Septi, can you get back, babe? What can you do? Before I decide, let me just quickly check what happened here. Now that was my boat. Who's rocking up where? You. Eris. Eris, you slippery devil. Can Vito get back? No. Oh, Eris. Okay, well that is a nuisance. It's not easy for me to get back here again. Mm, I can teleport to here. Gallop back round to the purple. Uh, and then come back up and get it again. It's okay. It's not ideal. It's a bit lazy of me to let that happen. Could have had Vitamina in the area. These trips would have made a pretty big difference, I think. Still not a gimme. Still not a gimme. 20 dwarves, 8 ents. So if Eris doesn't know any spells... And the walls hold. So if he doesn't know spells or ballistics, not a shot. 
trying to think of everything at once. Sorry. Sticky. Come on back. You might be relevant after all. Yeah. Right, come on then. Oh, okay, so I'm gonna get. Uh, am I gonna get there? I don't know. I am gonna get there. Wow, how many MP do I have left after? <laughs> I swear this isn't. Pre-programmed. How lucky is that? Three movement points will remain. And I'll be at the gates of Cold Soul here. Um, and we'll send Wistan out. Oh man. How lucky is that? Aiden, can you please disappear? That's so lucky. I have been lucky. There's been lots of luck in this com in this campaign. Leave what you can for me. The best of the best is probably going to be... Ghosties? Blackies? Pick one. Hmm. Can't say no to a good blackie. Let's do that. Boom. Alright. We stand. Old Nagash might get caught and stung. Okay. Oh, I saw an X there, a red X, and I thought for a second I couldn't do it. Hello. It's good to see you. I'm exhausted. Yeah, Nagash will die. Uh, which is a shame. Everything you've got. She's going to swap her artifacts out. Right, Nag. What's the best way of keeping you alive, man? Against corks. Hmm. Don't want to give you a ghost dragon. Is it just this? Good luck. Goodbye and good luck. <laughs> he can't get away. He's like, no. And uh, Septi gets all this. Um, so Cox is a moron if he comes anywhere near me, obviously. But the thing is, he doesn't know I'm here with the culmination of everything that I've done in the whole campaign waiting for him. So if he's stupid enough to walk around here, he can kill Nagash. Or at least make him flee. Maybe kill him. He has two archers. So he needs even chain lightning. He probably can't kill Nagash. Unless he has exactly destroy undead. Does she have a necklace that stops that? I don't know. Yeah, just stay here. Just stay here and be lazy. Eris. Well, Eris' army isn't actually that great, let's face it. But I don't think we can just leave the rampart like that, unless it's empty, of course. Oh, it is empty. <laughs> great. Yeah, 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 no, I did get to this point yesterday. I realised that Vitamina wouldn't make it, and this would be a really tough fight. It might be alright. Eight Ents and twenty Beardos. Have to just hit the Defend button. It just depends how good Eris is as a spellcaster. Probably won't work. Vitamina will have to come back and sort this out at some point. 
Okay, well, at least I know I can't defend that one, so that's something. This one down here, we have no idea if it's safe or not, but hopefully it is. Didn't have time to scout around here. There's no one to buy except these guys. Sea dogs, seamen, crewmates and seamen. Could buy them. I might just buy some. Okay, so that's that one sorted. What's next? Okay, this is Rissa's Town. Silver Spire at the bottom. We have a very big empire now. Don't think Astra is a great, as good a hero as, as Melodia might be. Is there any way I can find that out while I'm in here? Let's go have a look. Fafna's your best hero. Yeah, this isn't going to tell me anything. Look, Corks is a good hero, isn't he? Okay, that doesn't tell me anything. Okay, I found that the Iron Golems were great because they resist spells and they're hard to, just hard to chew through. It's basically a mirror match, right? Will I just do this? It's a lot of money. I think I will, right, because I don't actually... The thing about Fafner and Melodia, if they link up, they're going to have quite a nasty-looking tower army. So I can just... Even if I lose the fight, I can just deny them the troops. Are 66 skeletons worthwhile? Okay, they'll just have neutral morale. I'm, I'm okay with that. I'd rather have the 66 skellies. So there's a group I'm not going to buy here. Buy that. I'm buying at least a couple of these, right? Like, I know I'm buying at least one, because I'm going to want the spells. And then we just do this. Do I have enough money left over for the conflux? Hopefully I do. Moandor versus, who is it? Melodia. I might lose, but at least I'll leave a beautiful corpse. I might come back and hit the Master Genie. Do the Master Genie thing, buy a few more. Let's just see. So the next most important one to protect is the Conflux. And we are up against Astra. Behemoths with teleport, maybe. Gold dragons could be nasty. There could be four of them. Silver Pegasi. Right. So I think we probably want to go for the elementals as a starting point. Get these guys in a big blob. I guess I'll buy these, even though they're terrible value for money. And I guess I'll get these... We can afford to spend, you know, so we may as well just spend. Um, there's no hero here, actually. Can we have a hero? Neela. Level 8. That's good. Level 8 alchemist? Oh, man. Expert armorer? 4467. She's, she's, yeah, let's definitely get her to lead them. Um, we're going to need to get rid of somebody, though. Who can jump behind? No one can jump behind. Oh, she could. Okay, yeah, yeah. All right. Marissa, just do that for a sec. Man, managing a big empire is a challenge. Right, Neela. Yes, Neela, Neela, Neela. Welcome. Get rid of the gremlin. You are most welcome. One of the strongest of her kind. Hell yeah. Being able to resist an incredible amount of punishment, she's somehow still able to instill this resistance in the troops that she commands. Great. That helps. I want to be sure of this, right? I just don't want anything left to chance. 
So let me buy a few of these guys first, make sure we're cool here. Okay, so I'm thinking lizard men. Yeah, you got tons here, right? Lizard men, maybe some basilisks. Run out of money. Yeah, okay. Can't get to the trading post. I'm just going to spend my money. I'm just going to go for it here. Like, what have we got to lose? I don't need all these resources. I'm just going to trade right down. Leave myself with a decent cache of everything just in case. But yeah, um, these are good value. These guys. Something like this. Um, something like that anyway. Right, I've got 20 grand left. What do you want to spend it on? Are these decent? Maybe in a siege? 3k, 8k? Just get them. Just get them, and we'll go without the magic ellies. And... Let's just check what she has for her config. Goldies are at the bottom. So you should go here. So we want these guys away from the gold dragons. I don't know if that's far enough, but we'll see. And offer them these guys to chew on. And if you breathe on me, you'll get hit by me. If you breathe on me, you'll get hit by me. That seems okay, right? Plus Neela, great hero. Expert armorer. No, oh, just so nice, so nice. Right, I still have some money left over for Moandor. Go on, Moandor, take them. And down here, not as worried, right? Not as worried. Rissa, why don't you come back out again? And I left you here for some reason. I mean, I don't think Fafner will try it anyway. He won't, you know, if he comes up here, he's not going to want to fight me. That should be good enough. We've spent everything, but we've really protected everything now against the worst possible outcomes. The only issue is Corks, right? What he chooses to do. So let's see. Um, yeah, let's see what he chooses to do. Uh-huh, who's this? What? Oh, no, okay. Yeah, so she thought twice. Corksy gives it... Yeah, Corksy gives it a rest, but he goes into the dirt. That's interesting. Gem, are you up for it? No. Melodia is up for it. And we suffer a bit of defeat. It's basically a mirror match. So she must be a good spellcaster. Come on, Moanda, what can you do? 40 out of 60? What about blinding the genies? Seems quite good, right? We can also... They've got triple good luck, and my guys have neutral everything. So we are probably going to lose, right? There's just too much, me There's too much meat here. But, what the hey? Yeah, let's start with some blind. You can't blind titans, that's right. But I could blind uh, one of the other stacks. Yeah, this will stop the beneficial spells as well. Seems okay. And why don't you hit the... We, we were working on him with the arrow tower, right? So yeah, yeah, do that. Okay, that's cool. And my beneficial spell... I might... Hmm. I'll go for these guys. How long does that last? Six turns, not bad. Okay, these guys are going to fly over and do their thing. Um, don't want to fly out and attack them. Yeah, these guys are not long for the world, kind of thing. Am 
I'm okay with bunching up here and letting them hit the Nagas if they want. Instead of protect the Titans. I think I am. Good old landmine. Love it. Love to see it. First aid tent is switched on if I shoot you, but I haven't got a better target. And... Kill as many as we can. I'm happy with this though because even if we lose my land or like we've bought we've bought the town out, you know, so that's quite nice. Cause quite a lot of carnage here. Uh, let's see. Yeah, she's just continually earthquaking, which makes me kinda want to blind the archmages. Yeah, she's out of spell points too. Seems good. Pile into these. And the person I'm going to bless this time is these guys. Yeah, that's a good. That's a good shout by then. Okay. Yeah, but I can't get down to you. Mm, all right. That's fair enough. What should I do? Ah, I can get to you. And I will with my first strike. Yeah, no retaliation. I call it first strike because I play a lot of Magic the Gathering. Too much for my own good. Ooh! Ow! Yowza. I could soak up retaliation here. I don't think I need to, though. You're going to commit some serious... Happy with this, right? This is fine. This is not definitely a loss yet. Yeah. What, that's your plan? Well, next turn his titans go, then my titans go, and they'll be stuck here, they won't get to attack. Then his obsidians... No, my masters go. I kill four to six here. No, that needs to be a kill, right? So I'll do this instead. No, oh, don't shoot them. Okay. Is this even that bad? This, this kill. How long are these guys blinded for? Still six more turns and seven more turns? Oh man, that's so nice. So the arrow towers eventually will start shooting them, but not until they've killed these guys first. So rather than blind, I think from here what Moandor probably wants to do is shield, things like that, to really try to keep our guys alive. Just do that. It's just such good value. <laughs> I'm gonna do double for eight points, right? Because spell points, my spell points are precious. Thirty-four is fantastic to have when she's got nothing. Yeah, wait. I don't care if the harpies have a turn. And then this is an okay attack. This becomes an okay attack. There's also this. But no, because my nagas come up and kill that. So let's do this. Okay, alright, so she had one last trick up her sleeve. That's not good enough. Sorry. Yeah, look at this. Melodia, you've made the same mistake a lot of people who challenge me have made in this campaign. Oh my goodness. Which is to show up without a full complement of spell points. Like, it's your own fault. There's, I've got a good chance of holding here. I've got a very good chance of holding. I could walk her out and fight the Titans, but why would I want to? Let's just centralize. It's 
So, yeah, sorry if you can hear some squealing kids in the background there. Um, skellies will do that job. Yeah, she can't do anything. She's on zero. Your genies can wake up six turns from now. Golems and Titans are going to cop all the Arrow Tower. I think we're winning this now. I actually didn't think we would. But that's just because it's Moandor. Moandor can't be beaten in a siege. That's just... That's just a theory I'm developing about the way the game works. Seems to work. Yeah, he gets a nice shot off now. I also have this. I'm not really worried about... I guess I'll hit these guys because they're available. Mm, I might live to regret that. Yeah, so I can actually kill one, so I'll take that opportunity now. Um, and... Mm, one, two, three, four. How far can you move? I'll cast now, in case I don't get too later. Nope, sorry. Not that way, like this. What is it? Is that magic mirror? Okay, I think that was nothing. I think that's m maybe useless. I have no reason to do anything here. Yeah, you're gonna walk back up this way. Oh, you can get through now. Oh, I didn't see that. Okay, my bad. And... Yeah, maybe I could improve the combat ability of this stack. Bloodlust is only three points. Now, Wendell must have some kind of talisman or something that's given him a buff. Or is it the genies? Hang on, what do these guys do? Flies, spellcaster. Is it these guys? Was it the archmages? I think that's, that's my memory coming back to me. The archmages reduce your casting costs, even after they're dead, it looks like. I think that's what's going on here. Let's make you more deadly in combat, shall we? I assume this works. Yes. Oh, he doesn't need it. Nargus did all the work for you. Oh, I can even do that too. Do it. Who says random groups of skellies attached to a, an army aren't uh, good? Lots of people. Come on. I'm winning this. Can't come back, Melodia. You didn't bring enough spells. So I want to be a bit careful about how we wake... who we wake up. It would be nice to have... Nagas and Golems surrounding these as we wake them up. I don't think these two titans die. I'm I've run out of spells. Okay, right. Yeah. Come on out. I can kill one with this attack right now. Concern is that the Titan dies at some point during the Arrow Tower attacks, and then they wake it up, they wake the thing up before I'm ready. I'm just gonna kill one because I can. Yes, yeah, so that might have been a bit reckless of me. I didn't cast a spell in the end. This would be the worst case scenario. Oh no, that's fine, it's fine. Yeah, this is okay. It's alright. Man, he's a lucky titan, isn't he? 14 skellies he took with him. Okay, so hear me out. I'm thinking lightning bolt these things. And shoot them. 
I think I feel like I've played a little bit sloppy here in the last couple of turns. Yeah, that's just good, right? Just get him dead. Fine. Ooh, that's a pretty nasty hit. Skellies, 43 skellies will deal enough damage, won't they? Surely. Surely, he says. Yeah. yeah. Oh, well, you guys are going to wake it up. Okay, yeah. That's alright, that's fine. Do I act first? And she's not running, which means to me, she's desperate. This is Teal, is it? So we did hold in the end. Not enough spell points, Melodia. Charm of Mana. He's a Death Knight. Scouting's no good to me now. Moando holds once again. And we didn't end up fighting anybody else. That's interesting. So what did Fafner do? He did this. Which gives me time to do that now. Let's come back to that. What did Corks do? Oh. <laughs> We're just going to do that strategy of just being absolutely on his tail. And if he goes up into here, he's a dead man. That's our, That's been our plan from the beginning, right? Can even take some extra dudes with us if we want. I can't say no. I want to amass the largest undead army the world has ever seen. Now, you may have seen larger. I accept that. Septiana rides forth. She is not exhausted. She's fully, fully good to go. Okay, cool, cool, yeah. Okay, Nag, have a chat to her. See what you can take off her there. She doesn't want these things. Um, okay. You may as well wear that. She's not going to wear it. We're pretty confident, aren't we? I mean, Cork, Blue, Blue decided Corks couldn't beat her as well. We're pretty confident here. Like, look at the spell points, man. The sheer spell points of it. And we saw them mucking around in here. Running around. Did they come down? Don't think so. Yeah. All right. That's plan A. Plan A. Oops. Oh no, she teleported to the bottom of my pile by accident when I did that. I pushed the space bar and she moved into the... Uh, garrison, anyway. Sorry. I like having my best hero at the top of the pile. And she now she's down the bottom. See if I can work... I'll see if I can get slowly work her back up again. There you go. I moved her up one, one square. I think we decided this is a good move, right? To have Rissa ride out, grab these, because they're good soldiers. Yeah. It's the principle of the thing, right? I could have done that too. Day one... Pop around here. If Fafnir gets out, I just run back. I don't need to fight him. Oh, I missed this. Yeah, so Wiston. Yes, 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 that's right. That's right. Okay, so Nagash was going to buy these soldiers and go, go and upgrade them. I'm not sure we want to spend our money doing that, though, because we still have this problem. Crazy idea, what if I rode out? Don't need to. 
Neela can just do that job. I can do this job for you. Yeah, let me come here and do this. Corks isn't coming now. Nag, get the crystal. Sticky is there. This this is just an absolute trap for corks though. Like if he runs down through here, we're just gonna stay right on him until he runs out of options. Just really trying to just strangle them. And this fight never happened. I really thought it would. I actually thought this was the best fight that they had going. So that hero came back through here. Where did they go? Airish or whatever. Let me just quickly check the replay. Oh, okay, so Erish is underground up there. Sorry, I can't fast forward through the rest of the replay. Uh, that's okay. Who are you? Oh, yeah, yeah, you're, you're Gem. That fight happened. Okay, cool, 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 yeah. So, they're under here. Mediocre army, a long way from anything. No way you can take the stronghold. No way. If you come back this way, you'd have something to do, maybe, but... No. Okay. Stig, stay put. Vitamina. Okay. Ranlu... Come on, buddy. Mm. Can't beat Gem, so... I guess just stand here. Let's just see what she does. Yeah. He can't come back and get the town, can he? No. <laughs> Surely not. I don't think he actually mind that much if he does. Let's say he takes the town and kills Wiston. Well, I'm coming. I'm coming to get you. Right, I'm closer to the town than you are. So unless you've got logistics or some other way of getting out of dimension dooring away from danger after you've taken it, I'll just gallop back and take it, or I can take it back with um, Stig. So I'm not actually even that worried. This was going to happen, and now it has. There was much rejoicing. I'm ready to fight Astra if you want me to. If it comes to that. Okay, we're back on. We're back on, people. Another huge hold from Moandor. MVP. Unreal. It's a new week, so if anything happens again with Fafna. Yeah. Now we're in good shape now. Fortress, do we want to just go a little bit harder on the... Yeah, we can do. Yeah, let's spend our money here. This is good. So I'm glad we were building this town up. Uh, yeah. Happy with this, right? We don't need the Gorgons. The answer is no, but why not? Why take a chance? Okay. Okay, go for it. Now you don't know what to do. Neither do you. You're going to get in a boat. Oh, the fight's on. Corks thinks he can win. Oh, why does it do this to me every time? There's not a single fight Septiana has fought where it didn't tell me this. Twenty-two, twenty-four. So he's a better fighter. Fair enough. Fair enough. I accept that. Plus, he has these really annoying guys that are so hard to kill. But look at my army. I've got this massive, cool army. All right. What am I supposed to do here? I think I like meteor shower as a starting point. I just think that's just a really good high-value attack. The Nyx warriors need to be killed with spell damage. 
if you can. So let's just start with that. Yeah, huge damage on these. I killed five of these, which means we got we got the ball rolling. I feel like that's a good attack. Even if I lose lots of ghosties, they're coming back. And if I keep them all up this end, ganging up on the ghosties, these guys can do a kind of a surround. We can get a kind of a flanking thing going. This isn't a thing where you land here and hit these guys because they have no melee penalty. And no ret enemy retaliation. They're really good. And good luck's amazing. Yeah, okay, so that's fine. So this was the price we're paying for that. But I keep getting lucky. Lost five in that attack, okay. And... Yeah, so air shield protects them against the liches. But the liches have the bow and arrow of righteous justice. Okay, so we are just going to have to let them hit the ghosties and then we'll come back, but our next turn is going to look very, very good. We don't want to just stroll in, in, in here into range of everything that they're going to do. Right. And weakness is going to hurt. I have no morale, so... Okay, they did fire a shot. I'm just doing this, obviously, all day long. I only killed two. See, this is the 60% enemy attack. It's just so good. It just makes it that Septiana's attack strength is basically negative. <laughs> now, that said, she's going to kill a lot of sorceresses. She could kill... These guys could kill one of them. These guys are going to be a problem. That's a pretty big stack of the seamen. As well. There's no right answer here. That definitely kills 11. I want to hit the sorceresses, I think. So we'll do the old crown attack deal. Good luck always helps. Not bad. Okay, they're in the corner now. That's actually quite nice. Bad luck, but we still cop the weakness. She went for that. Well, this is awesome, actually. This is perfect for us. Oh, man. You're wasting your lives. Let's ride out. Yeah, I'm going to come out into the middle. Vampire's going to have a great time. So if these guys come down and do this attack if I'm waiting, that's okay, right? So I think the vamps go here. And you guys are going to be acting. You'll be moving before... Yeah, come out, boys. I need you in the fight, right? And now I can just implode the Haspids and be pretty happy. Seven. So I was thing stand. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That was lucky. I didn't mean for that to happen, by the way. Yeah, they don't actually get there. If we wanted to do a, I think what I want to do is hit these though. So they're speed six. No. Okay. So they do have the discretion of acting first. I guess. Well. So I am taking the retaliation. The irony is you're not lucky at all. Lightning Bolt? How am I losing this fight if you're casting Lightning Bolt? And I'm the luckiest SOB this side of the Caribbean. Just go with it. Put an end to this nonsense with the weakness. I think that's pretty high value. I'll do that. Yeah, now you are copping it. That is going to hurt like hell. Why wouldn't I do this, you ask? Well, one reason is that my slow troops are going to be out of the game and these guys get to respond, but they get to respond anyway. Yeah, they do, but... The liches can hit that. 
Rule of thumb, get the Hydra count down. Right, it's like magic elementals. Get them, get them dead. Oh, did you see the animation of the melee attack he does with his saber? That was wicked cool. I love that. That was really good. I can kill not very many of them. Let's do this. I'll kill a couple of the uh, soldiers at the back as well. Okay, so this isn't a good matchup, right? The, the Nyx warriors do pretty well actually against the vampire lords. We're waiting for you to act. Yeah, we're waiting for you to act. Hydra does its thing. This is fine. Bad luck, and he only kills one. So the skelly pile takes the brunt of the retaliation. Okay. What should we do here? I can absorb this and hit that stack twice. Is that good? Or do I just want to implode this next turn? Yeah, I think I'd like to deal with that stack. Well, that seems like a waste. It's only 25 to 38. Well, this is okay. Whoa! Man, they're good! They are very good in combat. Okay, we want to run away from this guy now if we can. I can't. Feed on these, I'm just doing that before I make a decision about spells. Good. Yeah, I'm just going to implosion this. So that's like your witness, what do you want to do? Cop that. We perish. Nice, nice, nice. That's the attack that needed to get done. I lost more zombies than I needed to lose there. Two lightning bolts later. Oh my god. Corks. Lightning bolt. You haven't acted yet. I could kill you. I don't think I need to worry about 32 of them so much. Good luck and bad luck played a pretty big role here. I just don't understand why this was such a one-sided... Yeah, do it. I don't think I am attacking. Well, this seems alright. Do the attack. Corks is gonna die? Corks is dead? Wow. Uh, I haven't been thinking about how to minimize, you know, draw the whole game out to maximize my um, animate dead opportunity. Because I never really thought we'd live this long. I can have 50 zombies or 168 skellies. I don't know. Oh no, wait, I've lost all the ghost dragons too? Oh man. <laughs> I haven't been thinking about them at all. <laughs> I'll go for these guys. I've got to kill, I've got to kill corks now. Alright, it's got to get done. Because otherwise he'll flee. Yeah, so what did I lose in the end? 10 of these, 500 of these. But you wouldn't say that that was a hard fight in particular. I got Shield of the Damned. Oh man, great. Look at all this. Oh, magic Mirror. Awesome. Hey, question. Maybe Magic Mirror's been changed in Horn of the Abyss. I'll have to look this up. Um... It's utterly useless spell in the vanilla game. The Demon's Horseshoe decreases enemy luck by one. Okay, that's cool. So this looks like an uber bad luck artifact, but it's actually weaker than the little stuffy doll thing we've got. Air spells. Oh, that's why you're doing Lightning Bolt. Okay, fine. Disappointed in you, corks. Okay, we know what that does. A bit more defense. Oh, we're in the Ascendancy now, people. Yeah, you guys are out of ideas. Glorious victory against this pathetic army. I'm just going to accept. Yeah, because we just bought everything. 
We just went into the Manchester City, didn't we? We just went and bought the best stuff. Put the best uh, people in the right in the best places and gave them the resources they needed. Here we are. Top of the league. <sighs> Makes sense, right? You're out of ideas, love. Just let's just make this absolutely yeah. Let's make this absolutely crushing. So this fight will happen eventually. Because they'll just have no choice. But that point won't come until we conquer the Kuhlmeyer. Who should conquer Kuhlmeyer? Who else? Who else, people? So she needs to get upstairs, and then she needs to run over here. So let's do that. Before I go, however... Wistan and Thingo could give you... Yeah, yeah, I could do this, right? These guys are good. These guys are good. And you can't use the other stuff. That's right. Should have done ghost dragons instead. I just realised. That said, we could get you ghost dragons for that fight. If we're clever. Should have been investing in all these upgrades. The reason for that is that I have a second hero ready to rock in Nagash. He can be standing here ready right with bone dragons. Septi rides past gloriously galloping northward to victory. My queen I have a message for you. What is it? Oh by the way you should you should already know how to cast these by now. Boom. One thing we know, we think we know we're doing is this and this and this. Get that back up to maximum. Give me what you can. Crystal production, you can wear that, Wiston. And Shield of the Damned is better than this, you can have that. What else we got here? Power skill goes down by 10%, I'm already wearing that. Everyone's health is a bit higher, that's not much use to me. Should I just carry this stuff around? That's another copy of an artifact we've already got. Air spells count for more, give that to Twiggy if you can. Yeah. Cal. Hideous mask. Yeah, see, this decreases by luck by one and this by two. Shaman's puppet looks less. Like, this looks like a legendary artifact, this horseshoe. I can't do archery. Don't need two of these. What's this thing? Death ripple doesn't work on me. Didn't you know? I don't need two weapons. Attack and defense by two, or this by seven. Here, take this bunch of stuff. I have no use for it. I am far too powerful. As you command. No, oh, that was a mistake. I should have gone a bit further this way, actually. Because tomorrow I can ride up north and uh, give you some more ghost dragons. Septi's never been there, she's been in there. I'm not gonna go there, I don't think. This is worth doing. The other thing doing is she could pop in here on her way. That would be quite good. This girl is ready to rock, look at this. <gasps> oh, we can do a proper rendezvous. We can have a mega, mega army going. 
bit of Mina. Get that water wheel. Get in here. Do your job, woman. Uh, it's a ragtag bunch, isn't it? Do I need to spend this money? I don't, right? I'm going to save my money because... That, uh... That hero is not near the purple portal. She's down here, mucking around. She comes back up, comes down to the purple... She can't yet, so I've got another day to think about the rampart. What I'm thinking is, tomorrow we set off from both these two towns. This town and this town. Oh, well, I'm not going to have enough money. I'm just going to... Yeah. Let's just go tomorrow to the trading post. Buy everything we can. Ranlu... <laughs> Ranlu, um... Your army back at the fortress did all the hard work for you. Do you know who Ranlu is? I said before he reminded me of, um... Jerry Smith. I figured out who he is. He's actually Yaqueen Phoenix in Gladiator. You know how that character in Gladiator, when he goes at the beginning of the movie, he shows up to the battle pretending to be really disappointed that he's missed the fight and his dad is there, the Emperor, with, you know, um, Maximus and stuff, going, well, you're here. Father, have I missed the battle? That's you, Ranlu. You are Yaqueen Phoenix. He even looks a bit like him. There you go. That's it. That's what I think. Very good. Who is this now? Cuthbert, what are you doing? Why are you getting involved at this stage of the war? On their side? You're a fool. Have you not heard the great tale of the siege of Athenium? Heroic deeds of the mighty, mighty Moandor. Have you not heard? Come to here. G sets off tomorrow, gives Tamika a big army. We ride north with it. I'm not going to have enough money for everything, but I'll go to the trading post. I'm going to be pretty liberal with spending my money. Hey, while we're here, we'll do a quick one of these. That helps promote her a bit. Anyone else can do that move? No. Okay. Yeah, so Vitamina pop behind the walls, that's why we don't have her here. So you're going to be coming forth tomorrow. Might as well do that if we, don't, if we have them. Right. But let's just go to the trading post, let's just see. It might be okay. How far can you get tomorrow? I can definitely get there. Tamika isn't actually in any hurry though, so it's fine. We're in good shape here, it's hard to see how... They can come back now that Corks is dead. Like he's dead, dead. He abandoned their cause. Heroes never die. But uh, Corks is not coming back. And look, now they're just running for it. They've got no ideas left. Sure, Fafner is going to have a go at Moandor now. Okay, so they landed. They landed here, actually. Fafner landed there to try to take this out, to take this on. He's realising, well, that's not going to happen. Cuthbert, the pathetic moron. If he goes through this two-way monolith, the only thing that you can do from there is try to conquer this. And that's not going to go well for you, right? But I have a lot of notice. Okay. Septi. Come here, and we're just going to go for it, right? We're going to buy everything. We're going to build the greatest undead army the world has ever seen. Marching as one on the road to the Holy Grail, which we've actually already found. So that's not even a thing either. Let's do this. More vamp lords, yeah. 
yes, yes. Yes. Okay, and well, I ran out of money, ran out of money really quickly. I might use the rest of this money for stuff in the second town. Nah, because I'm not going to do bone dragons. Okay, okay, All right. So, all right, I got 17k left. Let's get these, I guess. Yeah, all right, fine. Well, that worked out. That worked out fine. All right, happy with that. Come to me, G, my faithful servant. Bring me an army more powerful than anything the world has ever known. You're not bringing me anything, are you? What did we decide? There's nothing here for me? No, okay. So, Tamika talks to Wistan. Great addition to the team, Wistan. I'm not gonna bother swapping artifacts around at this point. We are really in just such a brutal ascendancy. West End rides forth to deliver the army. Takes a little selfish sidestep there. And here she comes. My queen, I return to you with fresh troops. Excellent, West End. I shall see to it that you are well rewarded for this, Wistan. I have all my spell points, so while we're here, we'll do our little swap a rooney. Oh, love when a plan comes together, baby! Can I be bothered going here? Plus one luck, I don't need it. Plus 600 moves for one day? That's a lot of moves. Definitely worth doing. Definitely do this. Like defense, just uh, because we're doing a lot of implosion, and I think we're ready to end the game. Once I conquer this, everyone's dead by the end of the week if they can't recapture. It's more or less how this game works. I fear no one. Die. Hydras, there's not even anyone babysitting you. Come on. Mm -hmm. Oh, they can cover the screen, these guys, really. Okay, um, well, I don't really want, yeah, see. I'll just kill you with these things. Oh. Ooh, I thought I was going to lose one then. <laughs> I probably still am going to lose one. Um, kill all of the angels. Or all of them. What are these likely to shoot? They're likely to shoot the skellies, whereas the angels might attack the death knight. Oh, wait. Yeah, skellies. Cool. Okay, some first aid actually might be useful in case the arrow tower is a jerk to me. Well, I was silly with my meteor shower, wasn't I? I really should have... Okay, so hopefully they just still do the same thing again. Yeah, good. All I have to say about that. Ooh. Defense, Cage of Wardlords. Even someone as mighty as Septiana can still learn something. As it turns out. It's quite an annoying defensive garrison for any anyone coming my way. Oh, she's actually out of moves now. 
Who knows, maybe some another amazing blue hero come running down here, galloping through here. I don't think so, though. I don't think so. I think we are getting toward the end game. I don't think there's anyone upstairs for me to worry about, no? Uh, yeah, let's do let's do this. Recruit some more helpless souls. All right, just come back here, Rissa, and hang out. You don't really, I don't really need you to do anything. Try and fly through this last part of the game here, folks, so that we can wrap it up. Do the post mortem. I think we're done. Yeah, Queen, come on back. I'm just not... I don't need to do anything, do I? I maybe have to worry about this cove. Keep an eye on that. Yeah. Going that way is not going to help you. Okay, Cuthbert is up for it. Yeah, he's just run out of ideas. And we do have a visitor back home. Okay. Okay, so we don't want to get sloppy. Grab 15 halflings, because that's always good. She has nothing, so she can just go do that job. Oh, there's not that many anyway. Right, you come on up. Can you get back to town today? Of course, sire. Alagar, that old guy, he's been ru he's been running around the map avoiding fighting as well. For all he's worth. Um, sadly, he's going to take our capital. <laughs> <laughs> That's so annoying. Um, unless we do something about it. Which I can't now because I'm out of position. <sighs> That's really annoying. <laughs> Abort everything except the wraiths. 42 wraiths can't defend this, can they? Nah. No. Okay, well, look, I'm sorry. That's so annoying. I can't do anything about it. I don't think I can do anything about it. Septi can't afford to stay here. She needs to come back. What else can I do to protect this? <sighs> hmm. Let's just buy them. That's a start. That's that's a start, isn't it? Lose the grail to this idiot? Is that what happens? I think I do lose the grail, right? She is of no use. Yeah. Although her defense skill's okay, I suppose. I'm not of much use either, but I do at least know. No. Animate dead. That would have been something. Okay, just a bit of sloppiness coming in at the end. What should I do? Send Septi back? Do this? Just get your butt back. The only thing we can do at the fortress is hire somebody to babysit and look around. If I can remember which one the tavern is. Clavius, Shakti, um, Clavius, why not? I had this guy, I had this guy recently. His family was always prominent at the court, holding a great deal of land and political power, and being the eldest son, he was sent to serve in the military, just as each of the eldest sons of his family had done for generations. He serves willingly and well. Well, welcome, Clavius. And, um, well met, good sir. Can you run around? Just have a look around, see what's what. See, there's stuff down there that maybe could be a problem. I think maybe that's what you should do, Flavius. Let's go down here. Okay. You stay here. You stay here. Septiana. I can give the army back to Wiston. Wiston comes downstairs. Comes flying down here. Nagash might be able to get further down. Yeah. 
let's do it. So we have a good supply chain going and we can always flip a -roo back and forward. Yeah, I'm not gonna split the army up and try and be clever here. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna do it, because everything else is done, right? There's nothing else. The only other thing is Moandor has to defend the has to defend that again. Which is just a joke. If I can get to here. Nag can get a bit further. Okay. Set set off. Well, you may as well have some artifacts and test stuff as well. That's better than that. Take this. Do it this way. I can't use the bone dragons, not really. I could, but I'm not. I'll keep the bone dragons. Don't need them to beat Alagar anyway. The problem is just we're a date where we, we messed up. If Tamika was still here, we could have given Tamika the uh, the whole army and done it properly in reverse. Ran Lu, he's going to live out his days hanging out in the fortress. Stig would have been an option. Let's just leave her where she is. Yeah. Do we have eyes on Thingo? What's her name? Don't need to defend the rampart. Where is that that blue hero? She got in a boat. She's over here. All right, this is so annoying. I can't believe I might get away with it if Alagar doesn't quite figure out where we are. Yeah, again, like a hopeless attack. I'm just gonna, it's Moandor again, but I think you guys get the picture at this point. He's just an absolute legend. Yeah, so annoying, man. Not quite the fairy tale we were hoping for. Plus I lose to Mika. the arrow tower shoot? Was it these? 100 points of damage. 110. Maybe blinding them is better. Um, So sloppy. I mean, I could have just left a week's worth of troops here. I didn't need this week. I didn't, Sepchana didn't need these troops. <laughs> you know, it's like, ugh. Damn. I uh, can't blind. One thing we could do is curse the Titans. So from an average of 50, they go down to 40. Can't curse a titan? Maybe it's a mind spell, okay. Hmm. Stone skin on my guys doesn't work. Uh, this is so sad. Like there's a breach there. Don't kill them, get the Titans. Not 
be fair, I suppose we do need to work them over too. They're only killing a couple per go. Oh, this would be insane if I held here. This would just be ridiculous. The Boneyard's doing work on the Ents. They're awake, but dead. Okay. Okay. This isn't, this isn't a thing. I can't hold. There's only one end left. Surely not. Should I go for this, actually? I get more bang for my buck, so to speak. I am not holding here. It's not possible. It can't be done. be done. I mean, what is up? Okay, to be fair, Alagar had one ice bolt. He only needed, if he'd had like six, six more spell points, he would have won the game. Or won the fight. Tamika, you've only gone and done a Moandor. Glorious is putting it lightly. I, that's, shackles were on. Oh man, the shackles. The ultimate ironic punishment of the guy who attacks while wielding the shackles. Oh. Oh yes. Yes, 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 yes. Be good at earth magic because everyone wants to be. Oh, blue, so who is that? Okay, so we do <laughs> we need to get everything back to Septiana again. Um, they are annoyed, it turns out. Oh no, who's this? This is Fafner, who thinks he can take this army down? I this is crazy, crazy town. Right, we need to get Septiana back to... Back to the real world. I just give this, we just do everything in reverse and it'll work fine, right? Tell me it'll work fine. It'll work better than fine. Got time to stop in and see the zombies? Nah, okay. I'm not even going to give you a chance. No, 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 no. Fafna has 60 spell points, it's not nothing. And what do we want to do here? What's the meanest thing I could do? I want to do something mean that's just not unfair. You know, miserly. Meteor shower seems quite nice. Yeah, I like the way that that went last time. Nothing like direct damage against a hero that we, we don't think is overly tricky. I don't really want to attack. No. Okay. Yeah. Alright, but I've got liches, baby. Titans won't like that, but that's all. Okay. Or I can do this and kill everyone. The Titans are going to do the most damage. 
So it looks like they suffer from the ammo cart being hit. Yeah. I would have thought maybe the develop developers of Horn of the Abyss might have changed the ammo cart, the way it works, because it's just... It almost never does anything important. Maybe they have, in ways I don't understand. Okay, that's great. All the damage is going one place, so that's great for us. Okay. Oh, this was stupid of me. Well, now that's a liability. I guess I'll just lose the eight wraiths, right? Because too many of them have died. 30? I'm getting sloppy. Sorry. Sorry, people. Getting sloppy because, you know, the, the finish line is in sight, let's face it. Yeah, if Afton's not running, it's make or break time. Okay, fine. <sighs> Wiston, stay where you are. Let's just keep the, yeah, let's just keep the supply chain going. And what a hold! That was a great hold with the raids, but again. It was a hold that was fueled by the fact that they didn't have enough spell points. You show up to my doorstep with no spell points. And you die at the gates. Who else do we have lurking? Is anyone else lurking? Randall, you don't deserve to be at the top of the roster, mate. Come back out, though. Yeah, and then you're at the bottom. Hey, we've got her up to third. That's pretty good. I think this game's over. Blue Hero's out on the water, running out of ideas. Teal is no more. Teal is no more, and it won't be long before Astra has to do something or resign. I'm guessing she's their best hero now. No, it's Vokial. He's out somewhere with some gold dragons doing something, so... Always be careful of assumptions. The army is here, I don't want it to... Uh, I'll do this just out of habit, even though I don't really care too much about Clavius's development. Uh, at this stage, there's a road here. There's a road here and there's stuff here. Okay, so question, is there a town in here? Do I want to check it out? Let's check it out, but in the process of checking it out, leave the fortress able to defend itself. Uh, so let's do something like this. Units that tend to do, don't do anything anyway. Well, it can't defend itself, but it can not going to need those rates. And then she goes on this big long journey. Do we know enough? Are we happy that Clavius has told us enough? And what's our what's our alternative if we're wrong? Okay, actually, yeah, no, this, this is going to work. It, it, it will be okay because 
at least for one day, if Septienne is there and we're wrong, she can gallop back up again. We can hire a hero who runs out of that gate to do things. See, there's all this down here too, which is... There's more going on up, up and round through here in the underground. There's at least one more town. There has to be. There's got to be. Stay where you are for now, Nagash. Nagash is here in case I need to get troops down to here from here, yeah. Um, it's a bit sloppy. I don't know exactly what's going on down here. So there is a blue hero interested in coming back and landing here, and it is Astra. However, if she lands here on day one, you know, I'm going to be able to deal with that. How would I deal with it, you ask? Well, Nagash can get to here. Wistan can get to there. week's worth of troops, plus this, plus Tamika, in fact it's Tamika, do I need to reinforce or will I just go for it now? What do you guys reckon? One week's worth of troops here in Dark Eternal is enough to beat Astra? Let's make it a, let's see, let's, let's find out. Clavius, go ahead mate, just make sure that this is something worth my my time. Uh, I don't know if it is. All right. I'm gonna. I'm not stopping for anything here. I need to hurry up. So the other thing we think we could do is get ready for reinforcements from here. And the way to do that would be to put anyone behind a wall that we can by dismissing these guys that we've <laughs> made such a fuss of trying to get ran loose. Sorry, pal. All right. Okay, here's an idea, right? Back here we can finally build the... Yeah, so Nagash is the guy. Nagash rides back. On day seven, we prepare the way by finally getting the Dragon Bolt up. We get another person out there, Jem. Well, seeing the error of her, error of her ways. Prove your loyalty to me, Jem. Your loyalty to me. No, no! You monster! You can't be serious! This isn't worth it! This isn't what I signed up for! You must sacrifice your only centaur for me! <laughs> oh, yes. Do you feel the pure evil coursing through your veins, Jem? Breathe it in, my child. Welcome to the darkness. Jem is going to come to here. Well, how far can you get? She can get to there. We're preparing to defend against Astra coming up onto the surface. Good old Nag, the logistics dog, he's gonna... He can get all the way to there tomorrow. So, Jem, go ahead and go as far as you can. Right, we've invested for the day here. Okay, we could do liches tomorrow. Get everything out of here. Come galloping down. Jem comes up from the underground, gives the stuff to 
G, or it could even be to make it. So we could annoyingly stand here, and then that way if she lands here, it doesn't matter if she lands here, it doesn't matter. I think that's what I want to do, right? And then if I'm somehow wrong about this... Um, but I won't be right. If I stand there, there's nothing she can do. I don't think there's anywhere she can land that will block me off. G meanwhile goes and gets ready for horsies. Okay, Wistan, you're kind of out of the loop, but near the trading post, that could be useful. Stig, I could have used you instead of hiring Gem, maybe. Yeah, Stig could have... Well, maybe. Doesn't matter. Okay. It's just Astra I'm worried about, right? Who have you got left? Yeah, here she comes. Okay. Crewmate, but that's too late to help you. Now, Tamika, are you the person I want to fight this fight? There's some crewmates. Yeah, we just want to kill her on the coast where she stands. I could gallop back to the town. I think that's what I plan to do, if I'm honest. I think I will do that, let her gallop up into here, and then I'll come out and kill her. Okay, so we buy the stuff here first. Um, yeah, and we definitely have enough money to do this. Um, and learning my lesson a little bit, I'll leave a little bit of beef back, just in case. Uh, not enough room in the garrison, because I have to do this. And this. Oh, the whites stink. Okay, fine. What do you mean there's not enough room? These need to be upgraded. So these soldiers will help the fight be a sure thing, which is all we need. And her artifacts are already just good enough, right? I'm not going to overthink it. She might want that. I was doing lightning bolts earlier. Okay. Jim might die here. Um, what is that thing? So on that basis, maybe I do want to take the fight today. I can get to here, so Tamika can get... Can Tamika do this fight if she has to run here first? She can't, she can't leave. Is that because of the crewmates, I wonder? Let's just do this. No, I'll just say no. Okay. Alright, where can you get to, G? You can get to there. I need to get to there twice. So I need to go here first, and I'll have tons of MP remaining. Yes, yeah, not a problem. We can just kill her today. Oh, guys, I'm sorry. These are 
rice. Yep, okay, cool. So, give me everything. Oops. Can't work the mouse, sorry. Don't know what I'm doing wrong. Pop that there. Grab these guys, come on down. And we will put an end to this once and for all. Okay, now Tamika's loadout, let's have a look. I mean, it's not an incredible looking army compared to Septiana. There won't be a doddle. Stop making excuses. Gold dragons are on the other side, so we'll do that. Yeah, I think that's good. Okay, people, let's finish this bad boy off. We've got uh, one big fight here with Tamika, and we're still a little bit unsure what Septiana might find in the northern part of the underground up there. There might be another town. I'm not sure. I'm happy with this fight, right? I'm happy that this is going to be successful. It might be a bit painful, but we should be okay. Tamika's a good hero. Okay, the auto resolver looks like looks happy. That's always a good sign. Oh, okay, whatever. Why don't you just give yourself expert stone skin? But you only have eight spell points. This keeps happening. Alright, so how many guys did I lose there? So I lost eight. And there's no resurrection. There's no animate dead going on. Okay, four gold dragons. Who's coming over? Who do I have to deal with today? Just these guys? Don't have to deal with anyone else. So with that in mind, we can blind, probably will, oh I do have animate dead, oh she got wisdom, oh look at that, 480, you beauty, oh wow, let's just start doing that, 480 is enough to get all 8 of them back and then some, okay this is, this is great, very very good, what else can I do, I could blind the behemoths, seems good right, like if she wastes her turn curing them and then what, like, that's gonna that's gonna be just good. You know when your gut instinct is just telling you to blind something? You know what I mean, right? Who wants to take the retaliation from the dragons? Who's up for it? And is that even sensible? So there's no elves here. Yeah, we just want to stay out of range of all these things, right? Unless on her turn she can haste something, but maybe, whatever. I think it's actually the dragons can take the retaliation. May as well do the vamps first. Yeah. Massive damage, wow. Okay, stay out of range. Happy with this? You can wait as well. My only risk is morale, right? Do they have morale? It looks like they have negative morale. Yeah, okay, so the skellies take the... Yeah, yeah, this is always just waiting, waiting, waiting. Vamps. Could do this job. Wait. Wait, and then the skeletons die. And then the zombies attack, but not on that square. Like here, maybe? Stand here to do it? Can't do anything with you guys. Well, I could walk down and do that, actually. We've got 
gonna want to blind the unicorns, maybe. Five to seven, that's useful damage. I'm actually gonna do that. I don't even care that they're out in the middle of nowhere. just too good, isn't it? I act before the centaur's next turn. That just seems too good to me. Oh, goodbye, Dolly. And we never actually broke the retaliation of these, but I think this attack is still really, really good. So I'm going to do it. Only two. Okay, that's pretty good use of her spell points, I have to say. Yeah, but this is just going to be blind, and then I'm going to transition into animate dead once all the other stuff is dead. So the dwarves and ants are still out of the game. This is what's wrong with Rampart when you don't have elves, and you aren't focused on shooting. So do I just do this and kill tons of these? Not really, right, because the dwarves have a go then? So while I just do this... Uh, the dwarves are going to get in. Ah, this feels a bit dodgy, but we'll do it this way. We'll let them hit us. Yeah. How many did I die? How many died? Six. It's pretty bad. You wait. You... Let the zombies hit first, yeah, let's just do that. Stand here. Twelve zombies in response, that's pretty bad too. Oh dear. Well, I won't be standing here by the time that matters. Yes. Yeah. All right, let's begin. Twelve per go. Okay. We stand there with these two units, we block the dwarves from doing anything. Okay, I might lose a ghost dragon here, that's okay. Yeah, we did lose one, okay. Yeah, if we just get out of the way, we might deny them a turn. Or oh, they can still come down here. Can't tell, can they get there? Doesn't look like they can. Oh, what's your movement? One, two, three, four. Uh-huh. <laughs> uh, this is fun. In fact, should I stand here and just let myself get root binded? Would I would I win that fight with um, regeneration, repeated regenerations? Why take a chance? Right. That's just better. This seems fine. Oh, no, it doesn't. <laughs> uh, oh. Dear idea. Alright, you idiots. So should I blind again? Blind the Ents. Right, and then we're just going to let her buffs run out. Man, they've done double every time. Such ninjas. Just come out of the way so I can see what's going on here, man. Right, you should move to somewhere like this. You can come up out of the way here. Uh, position ourselves a little bit better. 
and we want to be bringing back not enough okay well we know that that stacks and we're just waiting for their buffs to run out Just do nothing. Except this. Okay, stone skin's gone, but we might as well wait for shield to go as well now. The only problem is just that the behemoths are going to wake up in two turns. Alright, okay, so they're just blind now. He's blind for three, he's blind for two. Got five turns of blind there and three there. Should I just start shooting the behemoths instead? Why do that? He's got bad morale. Yeah, let's do that. So we'll try to leverage our stuff as much as possible. Okay, he's going to do that. You guys aren't taking part in this. This gives me a nice stack to raise back up here. So I'll have a good target for... Is that stupid logic? <laughs> I should commit suicide here so that I can... That might have been really silly logic on my part. two turns. They have speed nine. Yep. Yeah. Okay, we'll just go front foot here. Mm. Wakey wakey. Kill three. Oh, that was awesome. do it shall we why am I waiting a turn the reason is well hang on these guys still haven't acted yet so it's just the ghosties that happen now let's just get on with it I think I'm wasting everyone's time at this point come on all right so they've woken up they're acting after so we let them move okay she runs away anyway okay the fact that she ran away to me means there's still another town. Right, there must still be another town for her to have run away. Okay. Because when when the AI is out of towns and out of options, it just fights to the death. So let's see if we can find it. How, who would have known? Look at this. Annabelle up in the corner. I'm just going to pretend this isn't a problem. Clavi is just optimistic. Like, what? Uh, yeah. Let's just do this. This has to be it. This has to be the last fight of the game, surely. Stay in post. Stay in position, people. You're all good. I think the game's over. 
let's just check, let's just have a quick look at our thieves guild. It's Vokial and Gold Dragons. Well, I don't see any Gold Dragons and I don't see any Vokial. So what do you make of that? There's even more stuff? Surely not. What, down through here? Where else can there be anything though? In here? Has anyone seen Vokial lately? I haven't seen him. Am I about to lose a town to a hero I haven't been looking for? I'm not, am I? There's Wormwood, there's the cove. Here's the fortress with Ranlu. There's this. Where are you, Vokial, if you are anywhere? Vitamina's up here in the rampart, that's that. This is the town that Vitamina took, I think. Man, this is a big empire now, look at this. This is mine now. I don't see any Vokials nearby. No. Is that him? Okay, yes, 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 fine. He suffers a defeat and abandons my cause. No, well, let me just have a look at Annabelle here. This is a good use of um, resources here to just, let's just see what she can do. 6, 5, 9, 6, and 55 spell points. She casts something. Protection from fire. So she's not an amazing spellcaster, is she? Um. Always send ice bolts at marksmen if you have a chance. Handy rule of thumb. Clavius, you did it. You did me proud, mate. Thank you. You did exactly what I hired you to do. Let's just do this quickly. I might even just accept, right? Because I don't want to waste everyone's time. Let's get this thing done. Oh, she might need to pop in there actually to get the stables yeah 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 oh oh no it says alas and I was like oh no leave these guys here I don't really need them go hunt her down oh that's nice that's good I don't even care if she gallops past back behind the gates again right we're at that stage of the game. Like I'm just, I'm just being lazy with my other heroes here. I don't need to. I don't need to be a hero. Oh, that's what I wanted to check. Is this him? No, that's Eris. Okay, so where could they be, and where should I look? Should I maybe hire Clavius here to have a bit more of a look around? Or here, actually. He could check this out, this area. That road leads to something. So there could be a portal here. What could it lead to? It could either lead to a portal or an underground cavern, and there's no underground cavern. Subterranean gate is the word I mean. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So let's go to this castle here. Let's go to Kildare. <laughs> Uh, Kildare is a uh, place in uh, Ireland where I live. Level oh, Isra is here. Oh, <laughs> what's up? That's the orange hero. Oh, Isra, good to see you. <laughs> Should I hire him? Hire Isra? Expert ballistics, expert wisdom, expert navigation, expert lit. Scouting, expert earth magic. Yeah, well, I have to get Clavius though. It's a loyalty thing. It's a loyalty issue at this point for me. Um, I'm 
from down here. Yeah, so I'm not going to say no to Isra. That is really interesting in a big 8-player game how frequently that comes up after someone after a faction is eliminated. Look at that. What a hero. Isra knows Earthquake, Animate Dead, okay, all the good stuff. Doesn't know Earth Implosion? Okay. I doubt that Isra's going to get much time. Oh, actually, if I stand here, I'm dead, right, to Thingy. I don't really want Isra to die. Go check out the library. Leave them here. Oh, plus two to every stat. Now you are talking. Okay, just having a bit of fun here. What's going to happen? Where are we at? It's not here, is it? It has to be. There's, there's the end of it. If the, if the gen map generator has made a road, the road has to go somewhere. Right? Okay, let's keep an eye on that. She can have it, that's fine. Okay, Vokial. Let's try to keep Vokial alive. We finally found him. What have you got, Vokial? Uh, not enough. All right. What was that, Mirth? <laughs> uh, just, uh, so funny. Mirth. God, they've all got triple negative morale. <laughs> Why would you build your army this way, Bokiel? You're, you're a weirdo. Why would you do that? Alright, Clavius once again. Defeated, but in a good way. That helps me... Let's just do this. Yeah, 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 yeah. So it's just a standard sort of region. She's standing there like a... So-and-so. She didn't get behind the walls. Will I just accept this, or will we do the fight? Let's do the fight, because it's not a gimme, right? I feel a bit, I feel a bit dodgy if just playing it as, if, as though it was a gimme. Expert slow up front. She got instinct. Just seems really, really mean. And then shoot. Shoot to kill. Go here, I suppose, first. Oh. Mm hmm. So there's three units, I'm going to kill each one, so I think I can just do this now. A little more one-sided than I realised, I guess. She just gives up, right? Power skill by six, royal armor of Nyx. Wow, that's a new Horn of the Abyss artifact. Make some skellies. Put them in the pile. 
get this town back. And go and kill Bo Kill. So we know we're onto something, right? So he came out of this pocket here. Not clear what he was doing there. Isra. Isra, let's not lose you as soon as we've just got you. Let's just be a bit careful. Wow, scouting? What is that? Expert scouting? Yeah. Just like Fiona. Even at this stage of the game, expert scouting is good. That could be annoying. He might be able to get to me. But I don't care too much, right? I'm not going to bother swapping out, out her artifacts and stuff. She never went there. I should have done that, actually. Not this one. Um, hang on. I was thinking about this one here. Could we... Come back here for me, man. Um, I'd like to have someone in the area. All right, so let's say Vokil comes down here. Yeah, I'm kind of looking. Whoops. Ah! Sorry, 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 sorry. Sorry everyone, mucking around here. Um, let's get some scouts out here. Tell me what else is going on in the area. Make sure we're cool. Looks like we are. Okay. Okay. Oh, I didn't even look. Oh. Oh, this is Eris. Okay. Yeah, this is Pathetic Army. I, I saw her land on the beach. I thought, oh. Um, anyway, I won't play this one. I won't play this one. That's fine. That's okay. Okay, Vokial is running south after all. Okay, that's actually a pretty good move. I like that. So we can expect him to arrive... Not quite tomorrow. I mean, he has to run away from Septiana anyway, right? It's not that much of an ingenious move. Are we happy enough to try to beat him with Clavius and the Fortress? Why take a chance? Stay right on him. Isra could actually maybe come over and do this job for us. We have two undead stacks we'll want to keep. I guess lizards will be one of the ones we want to go for, though. Yeah, that's pretty good. There'll be tons more hydras here, too. There's just no way that hero can possibly get this army through the swamp quickly enough. Right? He's gonna come up here, he's gonna he's gonna get to about here. If I'm wrong, I'm not even that sad. Oh whoops. No. What have you done? <laughs> oh. Okay, I'm just gonna run. Am I just gonna run? I, I don't. There's no way I can win it, right? The death stare won't work. I don't have enough. Oh, 
there's no way. I just haven't. I don't. I don't think death is a thing here. You, you need a bigger stack of dudes. Flavius, no! Don't call him that. Come back. Right, you're just gonna have to do it like this. Alright. We lo I accidentally blundered the um I blundered the lizard men, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Please? Silly Billy. Hey, just surrender. Just surrender. Let's play it. Come on, let's play it. Might be the last fight of the game. You stayed with me this far. Come on. do probably just wait for animate oh triple negative morale like what are you doing Vokia oh the griffins would have flown away actually and escaped but oh this is nasty isn't it there she is Killed quite a few, and then the Black Knights will surely finish the rest. Yeah. Okay, and then the Liches kill that, so it's just uh, animation station. Okay, so that's it. I don't know if he can flee anyway if he's on a boat and I'm on the land. How does that work? Uh, can you flee when you're in that situation? I don't know. She gets even better. She does that. Yay! Alright! We got there. End of game. Good game. Good game. Fun game. Uh, I hope you're still with me and uh, it wasn't too going through the motions there at the end but um, yeah I enjoyed that I really enjoyed that I was a little worried early on that the map was a bit too islandy and that we'd overcooked the template um, in terms of tuning the thing to give us wa a water matter scenario I'm not convinced water massively mattered but it did kind of I had to get in a boat uh, you know Whoever that was down in the southeast, it was Ranlu, I think, at first, uh, sailing out on the water. The, the water kind of mattered. I, I think it was a good. I think it was a good campaign. I definitely made some blunders uh, as I went. I, I made some boo boos uh, and missed opportunities. Now this looks like a new screen and some new uh, font behind the in front of the flames here. So we managed to get. Total time 117, base score 164, final score of 328, which is no longer Archangel territory. Let me just quickly move my camera here. Okay, and you can see me there, I've just teleported my camera up so you can see my rank of Nyx Warrior. So we didn't quite make it to tier 7. I uh, don't know, I think that the Horn of the Abyss has changed the difficulty scaling uh, to allow the true 
you know, ninjas of the game to actually, when you get Archangel ranking, that really means something <laughs> in the Horn of the Abyss. As opposed to in the vanilla game where getting Archangel is um, more straightforward. Anyway, let's go into the Hall of Fame, shall we? Ooh, and there I am. And these are... Oh, it actually remembers my previous run-throughs that were... Which I've called myself Wu Ya back on it. Yeah, see, I was I was Archangels last time. I don't know. I think this might be the Inferno, this one above us here, the Peeble one, and then Purple Polio. I don't know what that was, but I was a Rust Dragon that time. So uh, is Archangel the best ranking? I don't even know. In any case, my score is not as high this time. Uh, I took a little bit longer than it was possible to do it in. But I had a great time. I learned a lot as I went, and I was very impressed with the Horn of the Abyss and the different changes and stuff. So, if you guys are still with me, as always, thank you so much. I really appreciate your company. I hope you've enjoyed the journey, and it won't be long, and I'll be back again with another epic run-through. Uh, so, until that time comes, stay well, stay safe, take it easy, and I'll see you again soon. Bye for now.